In November last year, when President Nana Akufuado came to the Upper East Region to cut sword for the construction of the Pualugu Multipurpose Dam, he also used the opportunity to cut sword for the construction of some housing units uh, which had been christened the Rock Estates in the Talensi district of the Upper East Region. Now, the site for the construction of this project is located at Pusunamongo, not too far away from uh, Pualugu. So today I am here to check if any work has been done on this site because the Vice President, Dr. Mahmoud Baumia, when he launched the delivery tracker, said that work was ongoing on this project. In fact, on the delivery tracker itself, it has been stated there that work is ongoing on this site for 120 housing units made up of houses and apartments. Now, the signpost to this project is located on the road, that is the main Bolgatanga Tamale Road. And there is a bulldozing machine parked by the signboard. Now, at first sight, what you think is that the land immediately after the signpost is the land that is going to be used for this project. But in fact, what is happening is that the area that has been cleared is deeper inside the area. And because of the isolated nature of the area, you rarely find residents around, except for passers-by who are using the main Tamale Bolgatanga Road. It had to take Nelson Tibil, who we met coincidentally, uh, to direct us to the place because he is a farmer who has his farms around uh, this particular project site. So it had to take Nelson to walk us through a sort of pathway that was recently created to get access to this place. And because it rained two days ago and yesterday, uh, it's been very difficult getting access to the place because uh, it is very muddy as we speak. Well, that was last that, that was last last year November when the president came here. So up to now, it was last Saturday, Saturday, Thursday that a driver came with a machine. So if, if before he came here, we could realize that he cleared a land. That was the very day. So we're also here doing some farming. So we let the farmer, as he was clearing the trees, we also cut the firewood. So the driver promised us that he will be back to fence the old things. So it was Monday that we were here when I heard some noise. So I could realize that that was the, the driver. He passed the machine, but he did not move it into the site. So that, and then what, yesterday was or Tuesday. And it rains yesterday. So today that I am here, I did not see anybody. What you will find is that there are a lot of trees around, a few of which uh, have been cut down to pave way for the construction but apart from that, nothing else has been done. There's been some leveling of the land, as you would see in the background. And then around it, there are some maize farms, one of which belongs to Nelson. Yeah, there wasn't any work here until last Saturday. We were not even knowing that they would come to do something here. They just came half a Saturday, anyhow. They, came, they just came to meet us here. Before I realized, they started cutting these things. We were even panking that they, they should we were even panking that they will enter into our things. We do not know exactly when houses are going to spring up on this site. And it is difficult to tell what exactly they mean when they say on the delivery tracker that work is ongoing. But what we can report is that except for the bulldozing of some trees and the leveling of the land and maybe the creation of the pathway to this place nothing else has been done so far my name is albert sorry reporting for joy news